Hey everybody, my name is Adam from Encounter Wargaming, and today we have... I'm Chaz. From Armies of Chaz. We're going to be playing uh, Commission Painting Studio. Yes. We're going to be playing a Zomortalis game, so stay tuned. Let's check that out. Alright, so we are doing a Zomortalis mission out of Book 3 from the Horus Heresy books. Uh, it is called... Void Strike. Void Strike, yes. Uh, I, we get some cool stratagems going on. We're going to be using the catastrophic damage table and uh, generally just going to see some crazy funness. Um, so, 1,000 points, Alpha Legion versus Loyalist Luna Wolves. And uh, we got some stratagems going on. Mine is uh, Flank Assault? Flanking Counter Assault. Counter Assault. I remember yours. I probably don't remember that. <laughs> <laughs> um, yours? So, I took, I took Sustained Assault. So one of my units can kind of respawn. Uh, they go back, so I, I wrote it down secretly, and when they die, I can put them back into reserve. Beautiful. And so mine is write down a secret unit, and it can uh, come on the board in my opponent's deployment zone table edge. Yes. Yes. Yeah. So, yeah, so we'll see what happens. I also took uh, one unit, could have void hardened armor, just in case the catastrophic damage gets crazy and the, the void of space floods into the spaceship. Um, hopefully I'll be a little bit protected from that. Um, any other important details? Uh, so the mission is the table is divided up into kind of four zones um, and we get, uh, there's gonna be some crazy deployment stuff we'll show you on the table, but basically it's one point for every scoring unit that is in the opponent's deployment zone uh, yeah. and one for every unit that's destroyed. Yeah, so it's like a kill point game, plus trying to get your scoring units to your opponent's deployment zone. So we're both kind of trying to do that. So I guess as the attacker, I'm trying to get into the ship, and you're trying to get me out of the ship. Get out! Let's get out of here, you know. I ship. <laughs> awesome. Cool, so let's look at the forces in the table and get started. 1,000 points of Loyalist Luna Wolves. Um, pretty standard Zone Mortalis list if you've watched any of our Horse Heresy games in the past, um, but slightly different. So, uh, just because it's smaller points. Uh, so here we go, we got a Terminator Squad, just regular Terminator Squad, uh, one Chain Fist, uh, three Power Fists, Heavy Flamer, and then the Sergeant just has a Power Sword. I got my Praetor Tribune leading the pack. Uh, his Warlord trait gives him plus one to reserve rolls. Uh, I have a veteran tactical squad with a suspensor web missile launcher, a sergeant with artificer armor, and a power fist. Um, Contemporary dreadnought with carries assault cannon and heavy flamer. And then lastly, I have a plasma support squad. The veteran sergeant has artificer armor and a melt -a bomb. And I have an apothecary who also has artificer armor and an augury scanner. There we go, there's 1,000 points of Loyalist Luna Wolves. Here's 1,000 points of Alpha Legion for Zone Mortalis. Uh, leading the force is gonna be a Delegatus. So this guy has a force axe, it's mastercrafted. Uh, he's my warlord, he's got a, he's got a um, warlord trait that probably isn't gonna come into effect. It's uh, one of the attacker's warlord traits from, uh, from book three. So if a unit falls back, in, if one of my units falls back into my Warlord, he won't have to test to fall back, but that's probably not gonna happen anyway. Uh, then I have a Primus Medicae right here. Um, he just comes with Artificer Armor, and then uh, this is a Pride of the Legion right of war, so Terminators are troops. So I have one squad of Tartaros Terminators here. Uh, we got sergeant who has a chain fist and a power dagger. Uh, the rest of them have power fists. Uh, I have a seeker squad. So this is seven seeker marines with uh, combi plasmas. Uh, the sergeant has artificer armor. So this squad, they get to choose one of the enemy's um, units to have preferred enemy against. So I'm gonna right now declare that they are hunting down uh, Adam's terminators. Then I have a squad of Cataphracti. So the sergeant has chain fist, power dagger. Uh, one of them has a power fist, and three of them have power axes. And then lastly, I have a Cordis Contemptor Dreadnought, uh, just stock with a twin lane heavy bolter uh, and just close combat weapon, twin lane bolter in the other hand. And that's it. 
that's my list. Here's our table set up for the mission today. Um, so we'll be dividing the table into four sections. There'll be 12 inch sections all the way across. Uh, so the deployment zones will go all the way across here. Um, the defender gets one end of the table and then the attacker rolls to see if they can pick any of the other 12 inch sections across the battlefield. Um, and so on a four plus, Chaz can pick that, otherwise his deployment zone will be the opposite end. But of course he's Alpha Legion, so he doesn't even care. Yeah, sorry, that's actually the other way around. Oh, um, so I, yeah. I'm at, right, because I'm anywhere in the ship and you're just coming on from yeah, wherever I'm you assault from. Yeah. Okay, so there you go, so, so we'll see where I am in the ship, this will be fun. Um, Alright, so that's the table, let's deploy our forces. Chaz, the attacker, has chosen that deployment zone. Let's see if I can pick any of the other deployment zones or not. Uh, whether I'll just be at the very back end. So here we go. Three. I do not, so I'm just at the opposite end of the table. There we go. Let's deploy them up. Here is our table. We're fully deployed. Of course, there's some Alpha Legion infiltrating trickery going on. Um, so let's start with that. The Dreadnought is of course stuck in his own deployment zone, but the two infantry units, of course, infiltrated up. Um, and what's the rule for that? Is it 12 inches away? Or you, 12 inches measuring? if they can't see you, so luckily the doors are... Got it. So they're there within 12 inches. Of course, plenty of walls and doors in the way. Um, and then I put my Terminators and my Praetor Tribune just behind this wall here. And I got my Plasma Sports Squad just behind this door. So. We'll see how it goes. I'm hoping that he can't pull off too many first turn shenanigans on me, but it will be tough to deal with all these units come turn two, or in my turn. So we'll see. Are you ready to seize the initiative, Adam? To Possibly. Try? Here's just the units in reserve. I have my Dreadnought and I have my Vet Tactical Squad, and then he has his uh, Tartarus and two characters there. So there we go. So I get to seize. Do I even want the first turn? Um, no, I think I, I think I want you to have it. Okay. Uh, so I could move. I could move up, open doors, but probably, yeah. I think I'm gonna let you have the first turn. Sure. Okay. So, Let's do this. Here we go. Let's give it to you. All right. Here's the Alpha Legion moving phase. So these Terminators just moved up a little bit, coming up on that door possibly, and then the Dreadnought opened up that door as well. Did he run in the shooting phase to come through? Oh, uh, I didn't run him, but I meant to. Can I yeah, run him he, now? I guess he, you, you end your <laughs> movement phase there, open the door, and then you run to get I think you can you can open doors as you go through them. You just have to, I, I think, you can like... Say you're done your turn. Oh, okay. <laughs> cool. Uh, all right, we started out, so yeah, you can just move through doors. So there you go, he just moved right through there, doors open. Um, and then these guys stood still. And then I, I ran him, so I'm gonna get another five inches of movement here, Sweet. using this handy Battle Brothers uh, <laughs> measuring, oh, measuring tool thing. So I'll get like right up here. Cool. And that's my turn. No shooting, no charging? That's it. All right. Just gonna wait. Get it out. End of Luna Wolves, uh, turn one. I played the coward role. I was thinking about busting through the door and bolting them down. We got the artificer armor sitting right in front. You know, maybe I get lucky and he rolls the one in the first one, or maybe I don't and he saves them all. And then my terminators die because they're the headhunted unit um, as well for those seekers. So that's not nice. Uh, and then my plasma, um, I was kind of pre-measuring it out, looking to maybe walk up here and open this door. But if I did, I'd probably only get one or two guys uh, in range there. So I decided that we'll just come around the wall and try and get the reactionary fire. And I move my Praetor Tribune into the Plasma Unit. Um, if they charge in, he'll definitely be a big help there. So there you go. There's the Wolf's turn one. Pretty uneventful, but things are about to happen. Stuff's about to get crazy. Let's see it. Turn two. So we're going to be rolling on the Catastrophic Damage Table. So we each roll a dice and we, we consult this chart here. So let's see what we get. Two plus two is four. Stable. Um, we're going to start adding to this roll at the end of turn four. Or starting on turn four. So turn 4 will be plus 1, turn 5 will be plus 2, turn 6 will be plus 3. Uh, turn 7 will be plus 4, I guess. Yeah, we cool. so far. Alright, well, everything's stable. Alpha Legion, what you gonna do? Alright. So, got some reserves, bud? Yeah, so uh, Alpha Legion, uh, turn 2. This is all one big squad. On 3 up, they'll come in. Yeah, they're in. And then they're outflanking, so... I get to choose where they outflank. Awesome. Finished the movement phase, those reserves came on from this table edge and just moved on six. Uh, these guys came around the barricade, Dreadnought moved forward, and 
the cataphracty over here debated whether to come through the door and, and charge these plasma marines, and they decided they will wait on the other side of the door for now. For now. So here we go. Let's see what happens in the shooting phase. Are we shooting anything? Running? No. No one can see anything, so just going to run this uh, contemptor up. Beautiful. Can I fleet reroll that? There we go. There he goes to six. Coming out behind the door. And I guess I'll run move the uh, plasma squad as well. That's good. Six. So just going to shift them up a little bit. Go. No charges then, I imagine? Nope. It's the end of Alpha Legion turn two. Okay, so I got two units in reserve. Um, this is my secret unit, of course, my secret, not so secret unit uh, for my stratagem <laughs> that can nice. rip down on this piece of paper here. Let me see. No cheating with cheatsters. Says Dreadnought. Bam. Okay. <laughs> so you can come in in the enemy's deployment zone, table edge. So there you go. Who knows if that's helpful right now. Hey, this doesn't seem that helpful. <laughs> <laughs> You're a victory point. Well done, sir. Uh, this unit can outflank, so let's see where they come in from. Uh, this will be the one, two, three, four, five, six, I choose. I can choose! Sounds fun. I forgot to roll for this guy. So here we go, two plus. Yeah, he's good. <laughs> so starting with my reserves over here. Uh, this veteran squad came in from this edge. Uh, they ran as well, so they moved another three. There's my one right there, and they're 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 the point. Their point of their entire life is to make this unit make some life choices if there's any left over as to whether they want to take that unit, prevent them from scoring, or blast terminators or whatever. Who knows? Who knows? We're just making Chaz make life choices. This dreadnought moved up six, ran five uh, from the opponent's uh, deployment zone, because of course I put a stratagem on him that's totally useless because he's not a scoring unit. Yay, 30k. <laughs> uh, these guys came over, opened this door, and I tried to get as many dudes with a bead on a Terminator as, as I could. Um, so hopefully we're just going to finish off that Terminator squad with one round of shooting. Um, the Praetor detached from the Terminators, and he's kind of hiding in this corner waiting for a counter charge. And then these Terminators came up. I'm getting my heavy flamer in range here on those guys. And uh, wondering how it's all going to work out <laughs> with this unit hanging out right here, too. So we'll see. We'll see. It's a big turn. This is where the action starts. Uh, we played Cat and Mouse long enough. Let's shoot. So starting off, the plasma unit is going to shoot the cataphract. We worked it out. Uh, buddy on point, the sergeant, can't actually see all the way to that guy back there. So we can kill them all. Um, I've paired out some dice. The big one will be the sergeant overheating, and then for the little mooks, we have four sets of pairs for the rapid fire and the overheat. Ones are overheating. Let's see if I hit. Hitting on threes. Oh, we got some overheats here and a bunch of misses. Oh, oh no. Overheat. Oh no, so many misses. All right, so four misses and two overheats. This is not good at all. Not good. <clears throat> so the overheats, do I pass my armor save? And I pass a feel no pain. No. So one dude will die. <clears throat> um, and he was just a regular move, so we'll roll randomly. One, two, three, four, five, six, we roll. The guy at the back <clears throat> bites the dust. So with my four uh, hits, I need twos to wound. So three wounds. Not bad. And you get a four up save. All right, cataphracty armor. Let's do it. Let's do this. Oh, sweet. Two kill two. Not the result I was hoping for at all. <laughs> oh man. Um, I guess I'll shoot a bolt pistol at you from the off game. Yep. Glorious, glorious fashion. Alright. Here, my heavy flamer is reaching out and hitting the entire Seeker squad. So, seven guys there. Lamo. Uh, Wooding on threes, and because it's no more Talus, uh, templates of blast get shred. So, here we go. We'll reroll it. It fails. Um, so, reroll these two. Alright, there you go, sir. There are seven wounds. Oh, brutal. Um, nothing's running, right? It's, it's no, I guess not, yeah. yeah. No cold void no at the cold moment. Oil, at least. I, so I guess, I guess I your sergeant is back here now? Yeah, so I'll do, I'll do two at a time until the sergeant. Sounds good. Uh, where should I roll here? Sure. Come on. There's one mook. Uh, one at a time. Another mook. 
Now it's artificer armor. Fishing for ones. Uh, so. I guess one at a time, eh? I am gonna, yeah, just, uh, Sorry, gonna, gonna, look gonna, out ta- gonna tank this. Tank him. Tank. Ping. There oh, he goes. Dead. And, and another one. guy. Oh. Man, not bad, so we'll reach out with some twin-linked bolt guns as well. Uh, well, comp, what are they called? Combi yeah, bolters? Combi bolters. Combi bolters. Here we go. Oh, rapid fire. Yeah, oh yeah, rap. yeah. Four guys, eight shots, and it's twin links. Good thing. Man, cannot hit. Cannot hit today. All right, wounded on fours. Let's see if we can finish the squad off. There's three wounds. Three wounds, okay. One more move takes it. So I'm gonna do something crazy, because uh, if I don't, then I think it's GG for these Terminators. Um, so yeah, let's let's just get ballsy. So we're gonna declare a, a multi charge. Oh, sorry, Adam. Before this happens, oh. I gotta do some checks. Do you something. wanna catch us on? Camera? Sure. Because they might just run away before you get to charge. Do it. So here do we go. Rounds. They're fine. Yeah. And then the Terminators over here took oh. some casualties. Oh, run, run, run. <laughs> No. They're good. They're okay. good. Cool. All right. So, sorry, proceed. Cool. So, yeah, multi charging the Seekers and the Contemptor with these Terminators. Um, it's a little bit bossy. It'll be a disorder charge trying to make it in, so we'll get plus one attack. Uh, but a cool thing is on Mortalis, um, there's what's called reaction fire. Reaction fire. So, so, make an initiative check to fire full ballistic skill here. Initiative check failed. failed. This okay. squad is so disappointing. Um, I don't Can know. Did you get to fire Overwatch? I don't know. I'm not sure. Um, oh, oh, yeah. oh, remembering rules. <laughs> if it was 8th edition, he could. 7th edition, you're the, you're the 3rd key expert. It's all you've been playing. Um, I never see, like, <laughs> double Doesn't charges. I never, like... Uh, let's, I'll just check the book. Would he, if he was the primary target, would he get to Overwatch? Yeah. Yeah, then I, you should. Okay, I cool. Know. So I will reaction fire test him then. Yeah. Passes. Good. And then I got that twin-linked heavy bolter. And like that. Three hits. Three hits. No threes. So we got so one, a two, and a five. So yeah, one, one armor save. I guess it'll be my heavy flamer probably. So two up. We're good. Oh, and I guess turn like bolter as well. Ah. Hits. So uh, yeah. Sorry, it should be another shot. So hits and doesn't move, and yeah, then the other shot. shot. Twin linked. Hits. hits. And. Um, so it's not a combi bolter, it's just, is it, yeah, right, sorry, rapid right fire, sorry. I'm getting confused yeah. about things again. That's one so move. Alright, so it up again. We're good. Cool. So now the charge range you're looking for, probably. Yeah, so here, let's pre-measure this so there's no shenanigans going on. So, let's like see. to me. Yeah, because it's just over five. Alright, let's make that six. Whoop. We got an eight. Beautiful. Nice. That'll be good. So what we're going to do is we're going to put this heavy flamer in here, because he has to. Um, this guy will take the full eight and just get right in there, and then all these guys will come around to munch on your dreadnought right there. So that's my charge. We'll see how it goes. I see. Um, I don't think I'm gonna charge here. Oh, you know what? I forgot one thing. Sorry, we um, one thing. I, thing? I failed the reaction fire for the seekers, but they can still do regular, regular overwatch. overwatch. Oh, okay, good, yeah. good, good, good. <laughs> let's do it. So here we go. Uh, first guy. Um, he's got preferred enemy against his squad. So that reroll one. Right, so reroll that one. Over here again. No. Uh, yeah, and then the other guy. No. Nothing. Alright, so everything's good. We're good. We did it right eventually. Gotta love switching games all the time. Uh, let's see what happens. It's, it's gonna be action packed. It's gonna be exciting. Alright, Terminators um, are gonna go. Oh, well, sorry. The Power Sword in the Terminator Squad, initiative step four, and the Cordis Dreadnought, initiative step four. So I'll roll my Power Sword first, because I charge. Um, looking to hit on fours, I guess, against Seekers. Okay. <laughs> we got the Cordis Dreadnought, I'm gonna yeah. smack some guys down. Do it. Got two hits. I like it. Moving on twos. Two wounds. Two wounds. All right, so I'll put uh, one on the closest is his power fist, I guess. Uh, he fails, so he'll get munched, and then I guess it's still closest. You can you can do that guy. Do that, yeah, Keep that's, your that's what I want. Yeah, I know. Oh, he dies too. Oh. He gets munched. Not good. Um, okay, so wait, are these initiative four as well? Uh, yeah, my guys. <laughs> yeah, they're not likely to do anything because they have 
one attack, but here we go. We'll try. One hit. hit. No way. Alright. Um. Power fist time. Yeah. At the initiative step. <clears throat> one. Can I pile in any direction I want? Um. I think. Okay. Power fist piling in. Cool. Gonna go on him. Technically, um, he had to be in base contact already with that guy, so I don't know if he can move. Oh, oh right, right, because that was my first was charger. First yeah, charger. yeah, you're right, you're right. So he's got to stay there. Okay, so chain fist, chain fist going on the dreadnought. Oh, I'm so worried about it. Hitting on fours. Does he weapon skill four? Oh yeah. Okay. Big whammy. It's one. There you go. There you go. Two d six. Armor bane. Come together. Armor bane. Oh, oh. So, sad. so it's eleven. Doesn't even do no, that. No, that's so bad. Oh, this power fist munching those two. No, oh, head. that's brutal. So bad. <laughs> so I lose combat. Yeah, I lose combat by two. I guess. So do I stay? I do. Just, Woo. just in there. Close one. Oh, I'm sweating. All right, I think that is finally the end of my turn. Uh, yeah. Let's go on to Alpha Legion. On the damage table, let's see what happens. We each roll a dice. There we We're go. at nine. Something crazy is going to happen. Hullquake. Uh, everything is difficult terrain. If it is difficult terrain already, it counts as difficult and dangerous. Alright. So we're going to be slowed down this turn. Because it's interesting, because it's really close, but everything's difficult terrain. So let's see how far they actually get to go. Alright. Double one. Oh, come on. Oh, there's the three. Hurry up. There's the three. <laughs> so three inches, that's... Let's, yeah, okay, yeah that inch, yeah. Yeah, you can use that one. there, okay, cool. Or, yeah, you can use it. Doesn't matter. Like that. <clears throat> that. Go, go, squad, go. Uh, these guys shifted up over here just now. Oh, I should have rolled for them as well. I think they just moved like. Yeah, they didn't inches, move much. So. Yeah, they're good. They're, wow. <laughs> they could have used boots. that a second ago. <laughs> uh, and that's all movement. Shoot me. Right, so uh, shooting phase, uh, just gonna put some combi bolters into Adam's plasma squad here. Sweet. Combi bolters. That's right. Or just hit with, oh, almost all. Yeah. Almost all. Yeah. Roll that one. Got it. Well done. Don't roll that to wound, please. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry. Mm. All right, to wound. Oh, I said Pretty don't good. do that. <laughs> so five wounds. Oh no. All right, so uh, my sergeant is in front, so he does have artifice armor, so I guess I do have to do them one at a time. Two up. It's good. Two up. It's good. Two up. He's good. It's good. And he's good. Oh, Tanked it all. all. Ding, 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 ding. All right, it's charging up. All right, so. Let's see it. There's a big roll right here. Yeah. It's 2d6 minus two. What do you need to get? Let's put that right in there. Let's, let's find out what this charge range is here. So, is that, this is an inch, this, like, this is a four. Okay. Yeah, so that's a, that's a four inch right there. Okay, great. So four, two dice, minus two. Minus two to this one, I'm looking for a six. Oh, oh no! <laughs> there, done. That difficult range just saved my life. <laughs> it saved my life in a big way. And one more charge over here. Yes, so I'm gonna pass an initiative test. Right. Please. Oh, I fail it. Oh, oh five. So All you right. do regular Overwatch? Regular Overwatch, all right. So, uh, a sergeant gets one hit, and all four mooks again. Here we go. Give me some sixes. I got one overheat. Armor save. That's good. So the one hit. Do we wound? We do. Got a fractal armor. Four up. Yes. He's good. Cool. So it looks so like... A double one will fail because of the difficult terrain. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, close. <laughs> You're tempting me, bro. <laughs> All right, come on, here. come on, Isaac. All right, we like to do this combat first. Um, so, Chaz is going to initiative step one with all his axes that he's about to axe to mouth me with. Um, so, I will roll all my attacks. Here we go. We got four hits, wounding on fours, two wounds. Give me a one. All right, Terminator armor. Got some Termes. Nope, they're good. Got it. All right, so smacking you back with uh, an axe. I'll do the power axe here. This oh, my goodness. These, these <laughs> rolls are just wild, this game. Uh, power fist. Yep. There it is. Yeah. Oh, he's going to munch so good. 
Yeah, three, three. three dudes. Uh, and there's a chain fist as well. So three lookout sirs. No, a sergeant, a buddy, and then uh, my apothecary lookout, a buddy. Yeah. And then a uh, chain fist. Yep. So this dude, he has a bonus attack from the power dagger. So cool. It's four attacks on the charge, which is pretty nice. Ooh, everything. Oh, wow. He's got it. Oh, he's got it. Don't roll four ones. All right, there they go. Got the squad. Consolidate oh, D6. Consolidate them. Four. Come at me, bro. Interesting. So things have swung over here back in Chaz's favor. I was really hoping to just blow up that squad, but now they're causing me problems. But then also things swung back in my favor over here with the squad just just not moving very far. That whole quake's got them pinned down. So there you go. That's been, that's been, a, been a dramatic dramatic couple of turns right there. Let's, uh, let's do this combat over here. So initiative four, you want to do your power sword? Yes. So this combat could swing things again. Who knows which direction it's going to go. Power sword. I kill two seekers. Oh, no, don't want to get He's rolled four boards. Uh, so do the two seekers here. Yes. Two hits. Two hits. Two wow. wounds. Oh, okay. let's, let's call it cocked. All right, we're good. There we go. Uh, the, the Quartus Contemptor. Yes. So, three attacks. Oh. Ooh, there we go. Not what I want to see. All right. So at least only two. You're going to get big two four ups. Yes. Yes. Work. Oh. Oh, we could swing right here. <laughs> Chain fist. Ah. There's two hits. Uh -oh. First one, armor bane. Uh, eight, five, 13. It's a glance. All right, second one, armor bane. Oh, 13. Another glance. 30. What? <laughs> ah! So he's down to one. Right. He doesn't have an invul. Wow. And at, oh, my power fist can go from uh, here? Yeah, yeah. Um, on to, I guess, that's me that marine squad. Uh, no hits. Okay. okay. Well, I do win combat by two. Oh, it, uh, yeah, okay, yeah, so, so they might break. We'll check for the Seekers. Ooh, they okay. are broken. I can't chase you. You right. just run away because I'm stuck fighting this dread. Yeah. Ten inches. Ooh. I go way back. Straight away from me. Uh-oh, that feeds me right into <laughs> your dread dot. Beautiful. Oh, no. This squad has the worst luck. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, that's been exciting. So I guess I have to then pile in right here. Okay, you have one more turn to do your job, and you must not all die. Uh, wow, this is wild. Let's see what Luna Wolf's turn three brings. Dreadnought, has to difficult train. I've already moved him, so I might have to move him back. Oh, nope. yeah. Okay, he's good. Um, let's see what else I'm gonna do. Actually, he'll have to roll difficult train too. I've already moved him. So yeah, he goes back three inches. <clears throat> yeah, because I moved him to full six. So back on my base there. There he is. <clears throat> Difficult terrain, changing the game. Let's see what they get. Three. I think they're just gonna kinda stay in striking distance of the objective. Um, but, yeah. Who knows? We'll see, we'll see. We're not sure. <laughs> There's so much uncertainty. <clears throat> uh, that's my movement phase. Let's shoot some things. Let's start over here with the Contemptor. I was debating charging them just to get some extra movement, but I don't think I really need it. So let's lay down some heavy flamer right there. Put two guys. Uh, we'll just say that's cocked. And there we go. So two. Wounds. Two wounds there. And some saves. Saves. One guy got okay. roasted. Carries pattern assault cannon. Uh, all hits. Nice. And twos. Rending. Rends done. Bam. All right, there goes the easy part. Uh, well, I think that actually might be all my shooting, so I don't even think he has a gun. So, let's charge. All right. Initiative test over here. Uh, so, the kind of practice that I can't shoot. You can't do it? So, okay. Yeah. All right. Minus two to this? Yeah, let's measure. What do I need? So, it's just over four, so I need a five of minus two, which means I need a seven, right? Uh, that right? Yeah, that sounds right. Okay, here we go, seven. Yes, oh. eight. Oh. Okay. 
Paragon Blade on that guy? Definitely. Most definitely. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's let's get some. Time. Here we go. The Praetor Tribune charging in. He gets six attacks, digital lasers, and the charge on top of his base of four. Uh, I got all hits except for one, and he has Master Crafted. There we go, all hits. Um, so, Paragon Blade's plus one strength? Yeah. So I'll win on threes. Oh, oh. only two. Wow, Dude. this game, this game makes you think about your life. Cataphracty armor. Uh, oh. We do pace to them. But he could still insecure. Yeah. That guy. So I'll do that last guy. Yeah, um, that's it. There's some dice. Oh, thanks. So hitting you back with one power fist here in this one. Yeah. Come on, guy. One. And it is a wound. wound. This is a big roll right here. Slay the warlord. It's probably not even a victory point, but oh, he eats it. Of course, there are no command points in this game. There goes my printer. Ah, oh, you just rolled so bad. Dude. <laughs> so consolidate him a little bit. Six inches. Oh, it's such a big deal. What's gonna happen? We need this guy dead. Corvus Contender down to one wound. It's yeah. gonna, gonna hit them now. Twice. Two. Still leave me with a chain fist. Oh, one wound. Just one. We'll put it on uh, the heavy flamer. I wanna keep my sergeant just in case I lose this. No, he doesn't give more leadership, does he? Uh, no. Okay. I lose the power sword. Let's get rid of the sergeant. <laughs> yeah, he dies. Okay, attacking back with two chain fist attacks. Oh yeah, both hit. First one is a pen. Second one, pen. Do you blow up? Uh, these are AP two uh, or yeah. AP one? Uh, AP two. Okay, so no blow up. Cool. Uh, so he is done. And I can't consolidate some cataphract armor. Uh, yeah. I can consolidate. Yeah. Right, I just can't like massacre you. Yeah. Sweet. Yeah. <clears throat> Just go over here. There we go. Catastrophic damage again for turn four, because it's turn four, we will add plus one to the roll. Let's see what happens. Oh, come on. Just a six. Power surge. The ship's energy systems go into violent spasms, uh, blinding light, blah, blah, blah. Night fight rules are in effect. If they're already in effect, they no longer apply. Additionally, if they're being used, bulkhead and airlock doors may either shut or open with a result of a 5 plus. Oh, okay. Interesting. So it's going to shut and hit your contemptor in the head. And blow him up. I mean, I think that's the strength they hit. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, well, we, I guess we should roll for all of them. So that got a guy in the back there. Sure. Probably doesn't matter, but... I got one. A one? Okay, it stays. This one. Three. It stays. This one. Stays. Uh, this one. Stays. This one stays. This one back here, I'll roll it. Uh, stays. This one opens. Not that that matters much. This one, nothing. This one. I put down a lot of doors. This, <laughs> one, this one stays. This one stays. This one stays. Did we roll that one? No. Okay, you want to go for it? And opens. Sure, it opens. Did we roll that one? I don't think so. Okay. Oh. It opens as well. Oh. All right, power surge all over the ship. Ship's going nuts. Doors are opening, closing. Ah, what's gonna happen next? Uh, yeah, we'll see. So the craziness is over. The power surge has happened. All the doors have opened and shut, and we've started moving. So this guy is is moving over, kind of staying in the zone, but kind of staying relevant. Yeah. So he is a scoring unit, so he can just hang back there and be worth a victory point at the end. Totally. And then the other. This is an obvious move here. They got one way to go, and it's towards. Oh yeah. Towards my dead terminators. <laughs> so uh, shoot me if you want. Yeah. Okay. So let's just start shooting some terminators now. Beautiful. Five combi boulders there. Here they come. So this will be twin length rapid fire. Threes re rolling the misses. That well done. Well done. Good. No, it still misses. Twin link didn't help. Force wound. Oh, come on, dice. Uh, three? Uh, four? Four? And one Terminator goes down. My chain fist. Uh, and then I just have two pistols. I think only the just the one. Medicaid can see. Here, right. so. It's no move. 
Gonna charge me? Uh, yeah, it's charging time. So. Wall of death! Here we go. D3? It's D3 in this game. Yeah, right? D3. Two. We have threes with shred. Two. Two wounds, okay. Pop out, double one. Terminator armor! Come on! Oh, no! <laughs> this game is ridiculous! Feel, feel no pain. Oh, no, yes, you have a medicate. Alright, alright, alright. Right. No! Oh. We, do. we do wall of flame. Brilliant. Good work, Adam. It's, it's fitting for this game. That 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 flamer guy is your MVP in this I entire guess game. So. He's killed <laughs> so much. So now the charge range is. Uh, so that's just over a four. So oh, we need a five. Five. All right. Let's see what we get. Come you on. do. You get it. You get it. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, this is wild. All right. Do you have anything higher than initiative step one? Uh, just the apothecary or the, Do it. To the medicate. Do it. He's, I guess, three attacks, so four on. on the charge. But this is just a chain sword, so. All right. So one, one hit. Doesn't wound. Okay, so. Simultaneous? Yep. Oh, oh we're gonna drag two more down with me. But okay, you, you, you go first. No, you charge me. You get the, <laughs> the honors okay. of yeah, knowing. Cool. So do all the uh, power fists. Sounds good. Oh, I'll just count the chain fist as a power fist. Cause same, same. Same, same, I guess. Same, same, but different. Three. So looking for fours. Pretty good. Yes. Yes. Not ones. So Three. six. Six. All right, six four ups. No, he's not a beast. Okay, uh, he drags more down. He will. He will. <laughs> Kill four Terminators this turn. One. Was so one wound? We won't, we won't go back to that. One wound. Yeah. <laughs> I was gonna say, dude, you have to take a leadership yeah. test for shooting. No, because it's on Overwatch. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay. Oh, oh yeah, you could have fired full ballistic and used a template if that would have been better than three. I don't know. But Whatever, I'll take the wound. result as is. Yeah. <laughs> I'll take two dead. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so just one wound. Just one wound. All right, so uh, Tartarus armor, five up. We get one. I'm happy with that. Um, so that ties the combat? Uh, you died. That was just his last gasp. Oh, right, he's attacked. dead. Yeah, yeah, yeah he's, sorry, he's sorry. dead. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> got excited. <Yeah. laughs> so, consolidate. That was your MVP. That was your hero who yeah. just went down. So, just consolidate that two inches. So, you just use the end of that ruler or this. Oh, so Yeah, so that's two or something. There you go. Cool, I don't know which way to go now. It's decision of time. Da, 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 da. We feel like we've done enough work, and it's time to disappear back, back into the shadows for the elevation. So. so there they go. There they go. Wow, this game is crazy. Let's see what happens in Luna Wolf's turn four. We're gonna start with my suspensor web uh, missile launcher and do a frag missile because templates are cool. Uh, here's my scatter dice. It hits. There you go. So we get three dudes um, with shred. So normally wounding on fours. This is, is it four, right? I can't remember. Yeah, right. it's eight, yeah. eight down to four. Yeah. So fours with shred. There's two. All right, Terminator armor. Two up. You're good. It holds. So let's do eight bolt gun shots. Come in. Uh, and fours. There we go. Three. Uh, do two at a time here. Yep, makes sense. Good. That's good. We're good. All around goodness. Um, the heavy flamer reaches out and touches nobody. And then six carries assault cannon shots. Hitting on twos. All hit. Wounding on twos. Fishing for some sixes. No sixes, but six wounds. Okay. Um, so do two at a time for the Terminators until it reaches. Yep. Is he a artifice armor? Uh, yeah, they both, have have two plus save? they both have Artificer, but no invulns. So, just yeah. roll it together, because I got no random and stuff. Well, uh, Does it matter? Does it matter? No, you can just take them all in order and do your five of feeling pain. Oh, because I'm getting feeling pain too. Yeah, just, okay. just roll them all together. Cool. Yeah, two ups. It'll work out. We're good. We're good all around. Beauties, well done. Alright, um. I. Yes, yes, I decided not to run, so I can still charge. We measured it's out. that charge. The 10 inch charge, we measured it with fleet. Can we roll it? Can I re roll a single die, or do I have to re roll the whole thing? You roll, you can re roll just one if you want. If I want. Yeah. Oh, beautiful. Here we go. First time. Uh, so I'm needing a 10, eh? So a 4 is decent. 
reroll this for a six or reroll the whole You're thing? You're probably better off rerolling the whole thing. I think so. I think so. Let's try for it. Here we go. Eight. Oh. Not quite. Okay. You never know in this game. You never know. It's been crazy. So let's see what Chaz does on turn five. Table. It is turn five, so we're going to add two to the result here as the ship continues to take uh, weather the storm from the outside battle waging in space. Here we go. That's all right. It's a seven. Power surge again. Great. <laughs> is that the door thing? It's the door thing. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Okay. Uh, let's well, let's just do the just... doors that matter. Yeah, so they're in that close vicinity. Yeah. Okay, so this one. Uh, nope, and then you roll for those guys. So, uh, on my unit cutting it in half. That matters. No, it doesn't have it. Nope, that one there, because I do have to go that direction. Okay. That one toggles. Close. Alright. This one here? Nope. Um, and then this one for your dude, because you may try and escape. Mm. Nope, stay the same. I'll just do this one. Yeah, that, that might sense. matter. There we go. Closes! Okay. There it is. What are you gonna do? So this character split off to run off this way because we weren't sure if he could fit in here and get the door closed, and he really wanted the door closed so I could shoot him. So there you go. Close the door, he's hiding. This dude is going to try and go and hide as well. Nice. The Alpha Legion infiltrate my ship. Yeah, we're done with shooting, we're just running away now. Cool, runs, <laughs> do it. Uh, infiltrate into the ship, so I'll just run him. Five. So he'll so probably just not sure. It. I'll, I'll double check the rules. If, if you can go through that door, I want to get him through there. Yeah. But there, if then, you can do that. Yeah, and then the Tartaros, they can actually run. Three. So just move them back. It's the three-inch ruler right here. Oh, Straight yeah. kind of, or do you want to hide over oh, here? Oh yeah, you bring them over that, that way. way. That would be optimal. Yeah. Run away from the contemptor. There you go. There you go. Yeah. <clears throat> All right, so my turn. I just moved and ran at the same time, um, and something unexpected happened. I rolled a six for both of my units, and so we just crashed through this door. We're, we're trying to catch up and just obliterate all the scoring units, um, and, and we'll see what happens. So I can't shoot and I can't charge because I ran. So there we go. Let's go on to turn six. Uh, well, we random game length, actually. Right, it could we end. We could win right now. Sure. Okay. You want, me, you want me to roll? Sure, go for it. Okay. Here we go. What are we looking for? One or two it ends? Yeah, one or two it Okay, ends. we rolled a four. Game goes on to turn six. Damage, adding three to the results. Okay, oh, 13! Structural collapse! Uh, players roll off the window, indicates a single uh, board section in the Zomer Tiles board. All models with a toughness suffer a strength 4 rending hit, and all models with an armor value suffer a glancing hit on a 4 plus. So we roll off. Alright. Oh no, you win it! I took it! So it'll probably be, this is 12 inches to here. Yeah. So you'll probably have to choose, you'll probably want to choose that section. Yeah, it's 12 inches there, so it's like so. that's the section. So I can, I can get both these units. Okay, sounds good. pretty sweet. Do it, so glancing at a four plus. Four plus on that contemptor. No. Nope. For the infantry, uh, we're actually choosing this square to be clear. Uh, okay, so it was just slip this guy in it, and then these four infantry models. So the missile launcher. So wounding him on what is it? Uh, it's not strength that. four hit, so not that. Okay. And then these three guys, strength four hit three with rending. One wound, one wound, and he's fine. Okay, there we go. So nothing happened. Yep. Okay, we started it. <laughs> <laughs> it's quite the endeavor, but we got there. We got there. All right, what's next? Uh, you get to run away so far. Hiding back in the corner. Uh, continuing to run around through here, right? Did start no uh, he didn't, move, he didn't move. I'll just, I'm just gonna shift him around the corner. Yep. And why not close that door? Cool. Running for them. They're gonna run. One, one inch. I don't, I don't love that. No command points in this game. <laughs> cool. And then I guess he can't run. Yep. And he had to stay there. The door. delegatus over there. I guess he'll just He's like as far back as he gets. Yeah, I'll just stay there. I guess. Cool. Hide, hide, coward. All right, is that turn six? You can shoot me. Oh, no, yeah. they, did they run? They ran. That's why they ran, so nothing. So no. Yeah. Okay, here I come. I'm gonna get you. Moving wolves, turn six. Basically, pretty simple, just moving forward. Uh, let's shoot, so, frag missile. Ah. Oh man, it's going way off. It'll probably just hit the wall. Ah, uh, uh, it's an eight? It's an eight minus four. So I guess you're probably going on his head, right? So it's just going like two inches, or sorry, four inches. Four inches, yeah. So over here, 
Probably oh. nothing. Yeah, probably nothing. It's only an inch and a half template. Uh, so here we go. Eight bolter shots. Six, seven, eight. Oh. Here they come. Uh-oh. Not so good. Uh, three wounds. Pretty good. Okay, so... Just in case you roll all ones. Yep. Yeah. Two at a time. Yeah. Good. Okay. And... Good. Okay. Uh, let's do my rending. Yeah, because I can't heavy flame over my dudes. So here we go. Rending carries a solid cannon. This is the money shot. Six wounds. Ew. Yeah. Four wounds. Okay. Um, two at a time, I guess. There's one. Feel no pain. Oh, yeah. he's good. He's good. Two at a time. Got him. Dirty. All right. No Sorry. charging because I rapid fired. You're up. Turn seven. We're off oh, to turn seven. Some catastrophic damage it could end right here. Does it happen on a four up? Um, it keeps going. I, is it a, a three up or a four up? I, for, I totally forget. Because it gets harder and harder to keep going. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So four up now. Okay. Yeah. No, the game ends right here. There we go. That's it. Uh, let's count up some points. See who wins. Score at the end of the game. Six points for Chaz. He's killed four of my units, and he has won two scoring units in my deployment zone. Uh, I've just killed two of his units because he's got these pesky little single model dudes running around everywhere. Bummer. So there you go. Luna Wolves fail. The Alpha Legion managed to infiltrate the ship. Let's, uh, let's do a little post-game show and and wrap it up. There it is. The end of the game. The Void Strike. Well done, yeah. sir. Thank you. Alpha Legion managed to victory. Well, it's emotional. It was controversial. It swung this way and that. Yeah. The, the flank that I thought I would take, you took, and then the, the flank that I thought I would lose, I took. Yeah, so. it was wild. I mean, like, just just dice all over the place, like, both ways. I mean, those plasmas just jump through the door, they finally get the beat on the cataphracty, and they just fail. And then my Praetor tries to come in and, and kill those, the rest of those cataphracty, and fails. It's taken out by a lone power fist. That's it, that's yeah. it. But then my cataphracty turn, I guess, Cataphracty were like doing some crazy things this game because my Cataphracty like wiped that Seeker squad, finally managed to get the Dreadnought. It took them a while, but yeah. And then the so one dude, Wall Flame, two dudes. The Heavy Flamer guy, he took out, he took out what five Seekers? He took most of the Seeker squad by himself. Yeah. And then later, what, did he kill two Terminators? Kill, yeah. Well, three. He he wall Flame two he and he fisted he, one. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's that crazy. guy's your hero. It's crazy. Like, it's crazy. He gets a name. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's no longer a Joe. Uh, all right. Well, hey, um, any other thoughts? Oh, it was a great game. It's great to play Zomer Talos again. Yeah, it was nice to play. Uh, we, we didn't go with the exact tile maps. We kind of opened up a little bit. It was kind of nice to have a little more space in there to move around and stuff. Yeah, um, but it makes it hard to measure the tiles. That's kind of why we had problems with if you some a, of the If you use a gaming map. Yeah. We have like these one foot by one foot uh, tile sections that we use sometimes. Yeah. We use a game mat, it's, yeah, it's really hard. It's hard to get those measurements in, but it, it looks really nice. It's a very yes. nice map. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's Hot Dice Miniatures. Thank you for that map. Um, that's their Time Nomad map, if you want to check it out. It's the inside of a cool spaceship. I think he's making new ones so that it's like on an, the same pattern, but like on an angle and stuff, um, not just horizontal all the way across. Cool. Anyway, whatever. Uh, that was fun. Let's do more Zone Mortalis. You should do more Zone Mortalis too. You can see we just hand built that out of foam and cardboard, so you can make one too and have some Zone Mortalis fun. Someone days. needs to make people love, like, I'm primarily a heresy player, but someone needs to, like, figure out Zone Mortalis rules for eight. Like, I don't know why. If I played more uh, 40k, I would I'd be doing that. That's how you do it. I'd, yeah. I'd make up some rules and yeah. like, figure it out. And kill team Necromon is not enough. You want yeah. spaceship I want more action. Zone Talos in every system. Yeah, yeah. sounds good. <laughs> Zone Talos love. Um, hey, so that's the end, guys. If you like that, I would love if you just jump down there, hit subscribe, and hit the little bell if you want to uh, hear about our future videos coming up. As well, if you really liked it, you can jump down to the link to Patreon, where you, for as little as a dollar a video, you can support everything we do to the channel. Any tutorials, uh, terrain tutorials, battle reports, the whole nine. So there you go, guys. That's everything. We'll see you at our next encounter.